The son of spiritual icon Billy Graham continuing his father's work. Good evening, I'm Vanessa Van Hefty. Franklin Graham launched his California tour in Escondido tonight. 10 News reporter Anthony Perra spoke with him about the challenges facing our country. We spoke with Franklin Graham before he went on stage and he spoke to us very candidly about where he stands on some of the big issues facing our country. But he was quick to point out that this tonight was about spirituality, not politics. Flocks of the faithful filled up Grape Day Park to see and hear Franklin Graham. I've heard the experience was great and I wanted to see it for myself. I think it's a godsend. This is a blessing. His famed father, Billy Graham, known for filling stadium seats, including Qualcomm in 2003. Franklin continuing to work after his father died in February, but choosing to spread the message in more intimate settings. And I wanted to go to smaller cities. I wanted to go to places where we could have an impact. Franklin says he is not on a political tour. He doesn't endorse any candidate, but had no problem weighing in on issues facing the country, including the complex heated debate over immigration and the border happening right here in San Diego County. But we need to fix our borders. We need to make a, a system where people that want to come in and work don't have to risk their lives to sneak across the border to get a job. This is a simple system, but our politicians, both Republicans and Democrats, have not been able to make this happen, and I don't get it. His tour also kicks off two days after another school shooting. But we live in a different world, and we, we live in a world where Hollywood has to take some of the responsibility. I think our whole country has to have a very honest discussion. But his message tonight didn't dwell on the bad, instead focused on happiness and hope. I want people to know that God loves us. He hasn't turned his back on us. And tomorrow he will be in Pasadena. This tour will cover 10 cities across California with the last stop being in Redding, June 5th. Reporting in Escondido, Anthony Pura, 10 News.